briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The Supreme Court of the United States heard the case of Sheldon v. Metro Goldwyn Pictures Corp., which centered on the issue of copyright infringement and profit apportionment between a copyright owner and the infringer. In the case, a movie was made based on a copyright protected play, which the respondents had deliberately plagiarized. Initially, the lower court awarded all net profits from the film to the owners of the play. However, the Circuit Court of Appeals decided to reverse the decision and deem an apportionment of profits. The dispute reached the Supreme Court, which granted certiorari to decide whether an apportionment of profits is permissible in a copyright infringement case. The respondents, who were found to have deliberately plagiarized the play, argued that the profits should be divided fairly between them and the copyright owners. The Supreme Court ultimately upheld the Circuit Court of Appeals' decision, resulting in a profit apportionment between the copyright owners and the infringers. The respondents were credited only for the elements they had paid for, and the majority of the gains were attributed to their efforts. Based on expert testimony, the petitioners were entitled to 20% of the net profits, ensuring a fair division based on the merits of each party. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.